What's up everyone? This is MGamers. I'm the developer of Mass Effect 3 Mod Manager as well as ME3Tweaks.com. I've been working with Kiko Jiro over the last few weeks to get Expanded Galaxy Mod working really well with Mod Manager. So I'm going to show you today how easy it is to install. Now, Expanded Galaxy Mod with Mod Manager will automatically install all the required compatibility packs for your uh, DLCs. So if you have like Citadel installed or not installed, you might need different packs. Mod Manager will do all that automatically for you. So what we're going to do here is we're going to have the 7Z version of the mod downloaded. I'll put a link to that in the description to their Nexus page. And you'll also have to have Mod Manager 4.4 downloaded, which you can get from me3tweaks.com slash mod manager. So we're going to pop open Mod Manager here. We're going to go to me3cmm.exe. You may get a smart screen warning here. It's fine to run. It's just that it's a pretty new build, so not a lot of people have run it yet. So Windows doesn't have data about it. So once you open it up, you'll have a bunch of stuff start downloading. You'll have three mods here on the left. For the most part, this should always already be set. If it's green, it's good. Otherwise, you have to hit Browse, and you have to find your Mass Effect 3 directory and select the Bio Game folder, and then hit Open, and hit Yes. So now that you've done that, what you need to do is you need to drag this 7Z file onto Mod Manager's interface, and it will open up this scanner, which will inspect the inside of the 7Z file for mods. Uh, since this is a pretty large mod, it may take a little bit of time for this to happen. Alright, so we can see here now, Expanded Galaxy mod, uh, the version information, the one that's going to be released is a little bit higher than this. You have what it targets, all that stuff, so just hit import and it will import the mod from the 7-zip. This takes a little bit of time because it's decompressing the mod. Alright, now our mod's been imported, we'll click OK. And now Expanded Galaxy Mod is available here. So now, at this point, all you gotta do is click Apply Mod. Copy all the files. It'll run a talk on the game to make sure there isn't any crashes because of file size issues. And there you go. Now you'll just hit start game. You don't need to install any bypass or anything. Mod Manager's done it all for you. So Expanding Galaxy Mod is actually best played with a game that you import from Mass Effect 2. It's not required. You can also just resume if you want to kind of loose out on some of the content. Or you can create a new game and you'll get most of the content, but not all of it. This mod is mainly meant for people who play the whole trilogy. Uh, for the sake of brevity, I'm just going to go to load game. And pick Normandy. Just kidding, not that mod. Uh, this one. to the main event of this mod. The way you can easily tell that the mod is working is you'll have two terminals here that are selectable. And the, 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 and the uh, left terminal will be a little bit different. And you'll be definitely able to tell from the galaxy map. I'm quite not used to playing this on PC. As you can see, there's a lot more galaxy maps you can choose from. If you load into the map with directly from a save file, so say you're flying around, you get caught by the Reapers, and then you quit the game, if you load right back into the galaxy map, it'll load the wrong one. So you need to exit. You need to exit the galaxy map, do a quick save, reload the game, and then the galaxy map will work for you. But you have to make sure you don't load directly into the galaxy map. That's how you expa install Expanded Galaxy Mod. Say, though, you don't want to use this mod anymore for some reason. You can quickly and easily get rid of it in Mod Manager. Just go to Restore. Go to Custom DLC Manager and delete all the ones that are DLC Mod EGM. So, done, done. And now the mod is uninstalled. That's all there is to it. Have fun.